Symptoms of a bad brake master cylinder 1. Low levels of brake fluid If the brake master cylinder has a low level of brake fluid, you will likely have some braking issues. The first thing you'll notice is the brake pedal feeling soft as you lift your foot up on it. If there are no fluid leaks and the brake fluid level look normal, then your master cylinder is probably the culprit. The brake fluid in the reservoir needs to be sealed up in there and any hose connection needs to be tight and secure. If you find that there's a leak from the brake master cylinder and are sure it's not a loose hose, cracked reservoir, or leaking lead, get the brake cylinder replaced ASAP. 2. Brake fluid is contaminated. There are rubber seals on brake master cylinders that get worn out after a while. If the rubber seals get in too bad of shape, the brake fluid will become contaminated and turn a darker color. Another effect of worn rubber seals is the inability for the master cylinder to sustain the amount of brake pressure placed on it. As a result, the brake pedal will feel mushy and start falling to the floor slowly. 3. Brake Pedal Abnormalities When a brake master cylinder goes bad, one of the first things you'll notice is the brake pedal acting strangely. After all, the brake pressure of the braking system comes from the brake master cylinder. If it can't process or seal this pressure like it normally does, then you'll feel abnormalities with the brake pedal. Getting back to the rubber seals of the master cylinder, if they are worn then it will cause brake fluid to leak internally. Once this happens, the pedal will feel mushy and it will gradually fall to the floor after you take your foot off it. 4. Check engine light illuminates. Many newer cars have master cylinders with pressure sensors and brake fluid sensors built into them. These sensors will detect if there is something wrong with the brake fluid pressure of the vehicle. If it finds the pressure dropping, for example, then the master cylinder is likely the cause and a diagnostic trouble code will be recorded by the car's ECU and this will set off the check engine warning light on the dashboard. If this light were to illuminate then it could possibly be because of the master cylinder. Of course, you won't know the exact cause of the check engine light until you get your car scanned. But if the light appears alongside any other symptom here, there's a chance it's your master cylinder. Using an OBD2 scanner is the only way to confirm what error code is stored.